Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to be talking about those LinkedIn five-star profiles. Does it matter that you have a five-star profile or not? Well today that's what we're going to cover. Now before we get started, please if you haven't already consider subscribing to our channel. Ring that bell for notifications of future videos and give us that thumbs up if you feel like this information is helpful. So I have lots of job seekers that are constantly asking me saying, does it matter whether or not I have a five star profile on LinkedIn? And for those of you that haven't really heard of this, what it is is when you're first creating your profile, LinkedIn has a bar at the bottom and it tells you how you're doing in creating your profile. And when you get all the way to the top of that little profile bar, it says you have an all star profile. Well, last week, actually, somebody asked me, how do companies search to know that you have an all-star profile? And my answer to them was, we can't. There is no search filter on LinkedIn that says, only show me those that have an all-star profile. So does it matter if you have one or not? Yeah, actually it does, and here's why. While you can't search for an all-star profile, the reason LinkedIn is trying to get you to do that is so you add more data to your profile. And that's what it's all about. If you don't have the data on each of your different sections, then you don't come up in the searches. And that's what we're trying to do with LinkedIn is get past all of those searches being done by recruiters and companies and getting a person to actually look at your profile and see all the wonderful things about you. So it, when they say having an all-star profile, again, can you search by it? No, but does it help? Yes, again, let's take the example of if you don't put enough experience data for each of your jobs that you've held and you just put a job title and think that's enough, what happens is if a keyword search is done on LinkedIn, you don't come up in the search. Now there are all kinds of stats that LinkedIn has, things like if you have at least five skills on your profile, you're gonna come up, I think it's 27 times more likely. If you have a profile picture, you're gonna come up this many more times likely when people are looking at you, they're gonna click on you. And what I would say is you can get a five-star profile by just entering a little bit of data in each one of LinkedIn's different areas, don't do that. It's all about more is more on LinkedIn. You're not held like a resume the same way where it, the amount of pages you have can make a difference if it gets too terribly long. I don't care as a recruiter how long your LinkedIn profile, but I do care if there's not data on there and you don't show up in my search. So there is a character limit on each one of the different fields that you will do on your LinkedIn profile. Use as much of that space as you can. Like when you get to your skills section, you can actually have up to 50 skills. And I recommend you should put all 50. So while it does not really matter if you have a five-star profile, what matters is the data that's contained on your LinkedIn profile. I hope this quick tip was helpful for you. Thanks again, and we'll see you next time.